Petaverse to the 60th annual presidential election. Millions of pets from the Petaverse are gathered to elect a leader that will represent, defend, and protect the interests and well-being of all pets at the Congress. We have Natalie from the Cat Clan, Donald the Dog from the Dog Clan, Leo from the Rabbit Clan, Bella from the Hamster Clan. Now let's listen to their brief manifesto before voting. Natalie, you have the stage. Thanks, Steve. Hello, Petavers. I'll only promise you one thing, to leverage on my cuteness and charm, to control the minds of the senators at the Congress so we can have the freedom we deserve. We'll be emancipated. Please, Nat, you're fake. You all are. I am the president Petavers deserves. I will make Petavers great again. The whole world would bow down to my feet. <laughs> sorry, not sorry to cut you there, Donald, but haven't you been associated with fraud and caught aiding humans to carry out laws against Petiverse? That's right. He's too loyal to the humans to be trusted. That's a lie. It's all fake news. When I become president, I will build a great, great wall to isolate all you fake news agents from the rest of us. And I will have you pay for that wall. Mark my words. That's enough. No more talking. Pediverse, it's now time to choose your leader. Without further ado, let voting commence. Time up. Now let's see who the winner is. And the newly elected president of Petaverse is... Uh, Leo? Hello, Leo! All Leo does is eat, sleep, get fat, then repeat. How is he supposed to represent us at the Congress? Wait a minute. Leo isn't president. It's Natalie. Uh-oh. Not so fast, Steve. Thought you could give my crown to someone else. Nice try. But I'm still the boss. Oh, my bad. There seems to be a mix-up. The new president of the Petaverse is... I need to update this in the lower third. 